As a private well owner, testing the safety of your drinking water is one of your most important responsibilities. But many well owners don't know how to go about it. Some common well owner questions include, how often should I test? What should I test for? How do I interpret test results? And what do I do if there is a health concern with my water? It sounds overwhelming, but the good news is that you need not be an expert on water testing. There are some basic steps you can follow to reduce risks to your drinking water. First, a common mistake by well owners is to test their well water without first making sure the water well system is clean. Testing water from a dirty well can lead to false positives. In other words, the appearance of contamination, even when the groundwater is clean. A dirty well can also harbor contaminants, such as certain types of bacteria. A qualified water well system contract can determine if your water well system needs cleaning. Next, the National Groundwater Association recommends that well owners test their water for bacteria, nitrates, and anything of local concern. This should be done annually, or more often if there's any change in the water's taste, odor, or appearance. Contaminants of local concern can come from sources including landfills, industrial sites, hazardous substance spills, or the dumping or improper disposal of hazardous household wastes. Also, some naturally occurring contaminants, such as arsenic and radon, are area-specific. To determine what might be of local concern, ask a qualified local water well contractor, a certified water testing laboratory, or local health or environmental health officials. Always use a water testing laboratory certified by your state. You can find state contact information on the National Groundwater Association website, wellowner.org, under Water Quality. Also, some local health departments provide limited water testing services. Upon receiving your test results, ask the lab whether there are any contaminants that present a health risk, or check with the appropriate state or local agency involved in water well construction or public health. You can also check your test results against the US EPA's maximum contaminant levels on its website. Should any contaminants above levels of health concern remain after proper maintenance, including disinfection of the water well system, it does not mean that you cannot use your groundwater. A water treatment device may resolve any water quality issues. A qualified professional water well system contractor can advise you on how to proceed. When considering a water treatment device, make sure its specifications match up to the substances and concentrations you wish to treat. You can learn more about water testing by going to the water quality section of the National Groundwater Association's wellowner.org website. While there, click on 8 Tips for Maintaining Your Well.